Ryan going to toss. Patterson going to go left side. He's going to get the first down. He's going to get the touchdown. Cordero Patterson, a toss sweep to the wide side of the field for the Atlanta touchdown. Hey, what's up, Falcons fans? I have DJ Shockley. Would appreciate you guys for joining me today for Falcons Film Review, powered by Microsoft Surface. Two good plays for you. We're going to break down and talk about the first one is on offense, the big touchdown by Cordell Patterson, and it's all about the details and the blocking up front that I want to talk about. Let's jump into the play right here. So the three guys I want you to pay attention to are these three guys here. You got our, our left tackle. You got your two tight ends on the outside. Now we know it's a toss sweep out this way. Now this is a nice job of Cordell using his speed to get to the edge. Now he does his job, but it's also about these two guys right here on the outside. So it starts with Jake, but I want to talk about Lee Smith here. He does such a good job. What's he supposed to do is he's blocking the edge guy right here. But before he goes to him, he has to give a slight little lean on him because Jake has to come down and block him. Now, if he goes directly to him right now, this guy will get a feel and he'll probably disrupt the play. He has to do a good enough job of just getting a small shoulder on him to hold him up just a half a second so that Jake can come over and get this seal block. And then you're going to get a seal block on the outside, and that seal block is one that's worth watching. And then on the outside, my man Kyle's going to come around. He's going to block this this corner on the outside does a good job of sealing it for Cordell to get to the edge. Let's run the play, see what happens, boom. So let's go back right for a second. Watch the small little step here. You see this little shoulder? He stays on him just for a half a second, which allows Jake to get on him. And now he goes out, and now he gets the double team on the outside and seals the block here. Kyle comes come out here, nice job. And then watch this block here. Watch him finish this defensive guy here that gives him the edge. Boom! That's a pancake block there. Nice job by Lee Smith, pancake block. And now you talk about on the outside, Kyle Pitts on the edge, having to seal and finish this block. Not just a pass catcher, doing a great job of blocking and in line. And watch him finish this play as well. Nice job of blocking on the outside and CP using his speed to get to the edge. It's all about the details. It's all about each guy doing a small, minute thing to make sure the play works and it ends up in a big time play with a touchdown for the Dirty Birds. All right, let's jump on the defensive side of the ball. Well, I thought the defense played pretty good. Only gave up 16 points, but there were also some small, minute details on the defensive side of the ball that allowed the Falcons to be really good. Now, here's a good play here as the Lions are starting to get into the red zone. What they want to do is they want to use this receiver on the outside as a small little pick or screen because they're going to get him one on the outside and try to run his wheel route down the outside. Now, the guy who has the back and man-to-man -man is Deion Jones right here. But also these two guys on the outside, you got Deion Jones and you got A.J. Terrell. What, what he does so well on this, he stays so tight to him that he doesn't give a big bow here when he comes here. But Deion does a good job of going over the top. Because usually sometimes when you do this, they go underneath and then that's why they get the, the big play down the sideline. So I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. So here it is. Look at him getting a nice jam on him, not get playing too far off. And this is man covered, so he has to stay with him. But Dion recognizes here comes a guy trying to play a screen on him. And you can see the vision on the receiver, but also he has vision on this back trying to come out the backside. As he comes across, nice job of AJ staying tight on him. And then now you see Dion starting to close space on him. That's so important because if he doesn't close space, it leaves room for him to throw this football and it'd be an easy completion. But he's starting to close space early. And this doesn't happen from linebackers really too much. Now here's the thing I want to point out. Look at his head. He gets his head turned around. We talk about so many times, guys, don't get their head turned around. Here comes the pass interference. And this is from a linebacker. You don't usually get this from those guys. Getting his head around, looking at the football, not panicking. And now you get a chance to get knocked the football away, which creates an incompletion. The other thing I want to talk about, small things, getting to the quarterback. Now we didn't get any sacks, but here's the pressure I'm talking about. Watch the pressure come right through here from Taquan Graham. He's going to get pressure, he's going to get pushed right in the pocket, and they force him to throw a little bit off his back foot. Look at this pressure here, right in his face. Look at this, right in his face as he's throwing. Now, this doesn't come up on the stat sheet, but this is a pressure play that forces the football out a little bit earlier than he wants to. And look at him throwing off his back foot here. Look at off his back foot. He can't step into it and drive this football to him, because if he could drive it to him, that may be even better for him. But because he's got pressure in his face, he has to get rid of his football and throw it at a higher angle. And then we know Dion knocks the ball away. Just a nice job of execution by those three guys, getting pressure up front. And then the AJ Terrell playing really tight on him. And then Dion getting his head around and knocking that football away. 
That's exactly what you want. Technique and execution all in one play. All right, well, thank you guys for joining me. I am DJ Shockley. This has been Falcons Film Review powered by Microsoft Surface. See you next week. Oh.